Hello and welcome Gothic fans and especially Linux users. In this video I want to show you that Gothic 2, the Knight of the Raven with the modification Arcalos Chronics of Mertana is running on a Linux system. As you can see, I do have Linux Mint. This is shown right upper corner in my video there. And uh, okay, you can see here the Gothic starter. And now I'm going to run the German version of Arcalos. As you can see, this is a Linux desktop with all my favorite uh, programs and applications. Now we have to wait for a few seconds because it's running up right now and it goes on. So I have to say that this Gothic 2 runs with the DX11 renderer, the latest renderer, and Union 1.0M version. But there are still some issues in Union that I will explain later. Now we're gonna we'll load a slot here. And from my experience, I was uh, uh, using Windows, especially for Gothic. And since I have some issues, in Windows with Gothic, I decided to sh install Gothic under Linux. As you can see, I do have the renderer and a union is installed too, but there are issues. If I put a, a union VDF uh, VDF in the folder of the data in Gothic. So now I run a little bit through the nature here. As you can see and hear. Here is Terry singing a beautiful song. Okay. Oh, this works very well, I think. This is how it feels on Linux. And I'm very proud to have it installed mm, very successfully, almost successfully. But I already mentioned that, uh, okay, there are some rendering in... Uh, uh, rendering, uh, I want to say, shown here, you can uh, set the renderer to special values. Maybe I uh, am too large with this uh, settings here. Okay, um, go on now. So it looks fine to me. But it's always so that the landscape must be rendered behind uh, the behind the program, so it can uh, lag for a short time. But here, if I'm walking around here, as all it's all good. In Windows, I have had already um, so much lags. And I decided to run this modification on Linux. Now, <clears throat> I open my inventory and then you can see that's the normal inventory of Arculus. And now I'm going to show you what happens if I uh, put the Union Advanced Inventory into the data folder of Gothic. There is, um, is an error. One short moment please so as you can see i put the union advanced inventory vdf into the data folder of gothic and now i'm going to start it again and there will be an issue that shows up one moment please
here. Union hook, return types are different, left value and so on and so on. I think it's kind of a font issue and I don't know how to fix it. Maybe the union team can help me to fix this issue. So I can think that there's um, many people who think, oh no, Union doesn't work under Linux. I made a research. Now I'm, com I'm coming to this site where I can prove that Union Patch Gothic is for Linux. XP, higher, macOS and Linux. And maybe I can't I can't uh, download this here instead of I'm already uh, um, submitted my abonnement, but I can't download it. Maybe one of the famous union team can help me. And if you can do it, then uh, don't be shy and send me an email to my email address on YouTube. It, I will be thankful for this. So now back to the game. Now to the next scene. I drank too much with Jorn. Okay, this is okay. I jump uh, these uh, conversations. And now we're looking out. If we can find another adventure of this funny and very good made Arcalus modification. So, as you can see, no lags, everything runs smoothly, and uh, it's all nice and smooth. But Union VDFs don't work in here. Maybe there is a solution for this so i asked the union team for support thank you for watching this video and uh, <coughs> maybe there's a solution to run the union patches properly now come on wolf just eat these scavengers Okay, two of them all dead. All scabbies are dead right now. Okay, let's open the door and look for it. So that's it for all now. Thank you for watching this video and uh, goodbye. Ciao.